This problem is going to give you an example for solving quadratic equations using the square root method. And this is level one within the Delta Math Online system. So we want to isolate the x plus 3 squared on the left side. So we need to move that 47, the negative 47, by adding 47 to both sides of the equation. So when we do that, we have 2 times the binomial x plus 3 squared equals 58. All right, now we want to undo that multiplication here. 2 times the x plus 3 squared, so we're going to divide by 2. When we do to one side of the equation, you must do to the other. So now we have x plus 3 squared equals 29. Now we have the binomial square isolated, so we can take the square root of both sides. We're going to take both the positive and the negative root. Um, we're going to go ahead for delta math and leave it as square root of 29. So we're going to have x plus 3 equals plus or minus the square root of 29. So you think of this as two equations, right? It's going to be x plus 3 equals the negative square root of 29, and x plus 3 equals positive square root of 29. All right, so we subtract 3 from both sides. We're going to get x equals negative 3 minus the square root of 29, and subtract 3 from both sides. We get x equals negative 3 plus the square root of 29. Okay, now to enter this in the delta math, we can actually take advantage of the plus minus key here. And by, by all means, you could have, instead of breaking the two equations, you could just subtract 3 from both sides and have it as x equals negative 3 plus or minus the square root of 29. I just wanted to make sure I show you why there's two solutions, what the plus minus really means in this video. So let's go ahead and write it that way. It's going to be negative 3. We're going to use the plus minus key. And then square root and 29, and that should be our answer.